Hello my tubers. I'm coming to you live from my guest room in my bathroom. <laughs> we are going to do a fashion show, show off video. I got some awesome new lingerie and stuff in the mail from some very awesome fans. A big thank you to Eli and anybody else who is so sweet to send me stuff. Honestly, it's so nice of you guys. I always had, need an abundance of things to wear, and sometimes I just never quite sure what to wear, what you guys are feeling, what you'd like to be feeling. So having you guys be so sweet as to send me stuff means I'm for sure wearing things I know you guys want to see. So hopefully the construction guys that's at my house right now are going to be quiet for at least the 10 minutes I want to film this video because they've been lazy all day. Constantly hearing beep, 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 beep. I get it. You're backing up. Just as you can hear now. <laughs> so please ignore the annoying beep beep. I'll put some music over this and hopefully it won't be so irritating because it's driving me crazy. <laughs> so here we go. Lots of fabulous things to wear. I've got some sexy red lingerie, some fun blue stuff, some more fun red stuff. Ooh, this looks like a costume. This is a body stocking. I don't think I'll be able to wear this on YouTube for you guys. Sorry. But ooh, look at that. It's hot. And same with this guy, probably not a YouTube guy, he's a fishnet one piece. But we've got all these other fun ones we can have fun with. Of course, whatever is not safe for YouTube here will be included in the extended naughty version of this video on my Patreon, which is patreon.com slash katiebanks, if you guys want to check that out. So are you ready for the YouTube magic and all the sexiness? Here we go. <laughs> Okay, this one is just the top, and I'm still having to protect it. The bottoms were very, very tiny, so they would not fit. <laughs> the top's kind of sexy, though. Red lace, lots of cleavage. I'll have to pair it with a different pair of red panties, because, as you can see, the ones I got with it do not fit. <laughs> but still sexy and fun all the same. This one's sexy and fun and blue. It's very hard, I find, to find other colors other than red, black, or kind of white for lingerie. So anytime I see something that's blue and lacy and fun, it is an automatic add to my wish list and want list. This one's fun. It's lacy and pretty. Uh, top fits really big. Bottoms fit pretty good. I'm surprised by how well this one fits, especially after trying that red one. And it's very cool because it's got velvet strap across the waist and the garter belt, which is a very cool little accent. It's very, very pretty, and I like the blue. This one, yet again, not really YouTube appropriate, so we'll be covering it up. <laughs> or maybe you guys will just see a censored sign pop in. Of course, you can see this outfit uncensored with my Patreon. This one fits really great. I love the extra strap detail on the bottoms and the top. It's just fun. <laughs> I had a bunch of red stuff on my wish list because I found I get requests for red a lot, and I didn't really have any red lingerie, so we had to fix that problem. Like pronto. Plus, I just love the straps. They're fun. This one I can't really show you from here down because it's just like this right across the front <laughs> of my crotch. This one is more YouTube appropriate. This one I thought was fun and kind of interesting. I would make for a really great outfit for like a JOI style video. It is not quite as good quality as I was hoping. It looked like it was more of a more of a solid fabric and less of this super stretchy kind of cheap stuff, but that's okay. It's very sexy and the color is fun, so I'm sure I will have a lot of fun with this one. It's got extra straps. I think I would actually string this through here, preferably, so I keep the look going. That way I get more of the crisscross, but it's nice that there's a separate one here because then you can pop your tits out if you want while having sex or while teasing your partner rather than just being stuck in the whole get up the whole time. So it's fun and different. The back is more of a mesh. It's just kind of like a one-piece bathing suit, which is fun. I mean, if you're going to show so much in the front, you show a little less in the back. It's kind of how it works. It's a little give and take action. <laughs> This one's very clearly YouTube not approved. <laughs> so you can see this one for sure on my Patreon without the censored thing, guys. Sorry. But it's pink and it's fishnet. I'm a nipple stick straight out of it, <laughs> which is fun. It's high-waisted, which is sexy. I had a similar one before. It was like a one-piece bathing suit. This one 
which I thought was the same one is completely different, which is even better because they like to have changes. This one is completely basically backless with a G-string that comes up the back, ties through little side hooks, hooks and then ties the back of my neck. Super, super sexy and I love the high-waisted aspect of it. Just fun all around. Alrighty, last but not least, the maid, or the maid, <laughs> the nurse costume. I have done nurse a few times. I've had sexy little lingerie version, a full up zip up little jacky thing. This is a cute little dress. It, it fits just how I was hoping it would. The inner collar has got some showing of the stitch, which I don't like so much, so I might try to find a way to stitch that differently. But other than that, super sexy. Fits really well. Super hot. So my only question then, are you not feeling well? Do you need a nurse to come help you? I'll help. <laughs> Just fun all around. Please don't forget to click the subscribe button right over here so you don't miss out on a single thing. And these videos here, they might just make you smile. And smiling is really great, right? <laughs> Bye, guys.